Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. Alright, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a lyric video in Camtasia. Alright, so I'm going to show you guys how you can do your very own lyric type video if you sing covers or anything like that. You make your own music. I'm going to show you how you can do a lyric video and it doesn't even have to be like you're a singer or anything if you just want your own lyric video this is how you can do it so for this example I'm going to be using an Instagram clip that I made for Arit and she was singing a cover of Carrie Underwood's song Champion so I'm gonna play a little bit for you and then I'm gonna show you guys the, sh the section of the video that I'm gonna create the lyric video for so this is the short clip that was put on Instagram. So it's this part right here. Alright, so that whole chorus part there, where she's singing I'm the Champion and stuff, that's the part that we are going to do the lyric video on. Now before you even get started, you want to make sure that you have the lyrics on hand to do this, because if you are just going to do this by ear, just by listening, it's going to be difficult. It's going to take a lot longer if you have the text already in front of you on a notepad, if you have it on your phone written out, or if you have it like on a document on your computer, that's actually going to make it easier for you. Okay, so this is the example video. I'm actually going to extract the audio from this because I, I don't want the video because we're making a lyric video, so it's just going to be the lyrics and I just want the audio so I'm gonna highlight this right click and then I'm gonna go separate audio from video and this is the video and this is the audio and you know it's the audio because it's got the green and it's got all these little little graph marks here that means that's audio so I'm just gonna move this part to the side because I don't need that and then I'm just gonna clip the part that I need that I'm going to be doing the lyrics on. So let me just see where it started. Okay, so it starts from here. Let me just stretch this out. Okay, so it started from there. Clip that. Delete that. And then, let's see here. Okay, so it ends right there, so I'm going to split that one, click the S key, and then I'm going to click delete, and then I'm just going to move this over to the front, and then let's just, okay, that's what I want there. So it's up to you how you want to break it up, if you want to do it word by word or sentence by sentence or have a couple of words together it really depends on how you know how the artist is singing it so let's just play this again so i think i'll go i am and then invincible unbreakable so let's pull up the text here in annotations and I want the text to be this right here now I'm not gonna worry about uh, styling or animating yet I just want the text on the screen and then we'll worry about how it's going to look the type of font that type of thing so I just want the text here first so I am and then I'm gonna stretch this out a little bit more 
so that we can really break down where the words start and where they end. This is the part where it starts to get quite meticulous. It does take a long time to do a lyric video because if you are literally doing it word by word, it's going to take a while. So just be aware that it can be a really cool video, but it's going to take a long time to edit. So I'm going to I'm going to be doing a lot of replaying and replaying. So bear with me here. Okay, so it ended off around here. So I'm doing a lot of stopping and playing, and what I do is I drag the the cursor here, and then I press the space bar, and then when I want it to stop, I press the space bar again. I'm doing this so that I can quickly see, okay, it starts here, it ends here. So that word invincible starts over here. So I want to cut this I am off because it's now starting on the next word which is invincible so let's see here I am so it starts around here it might even be a little bit further okay so it might be going back to here even and this is a lot of repetitiveness and that's why I say you want to get the words down first, and then do the styling after. Let's see here. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the next word. So I'm just going to click on this, click copy and paste. The I am is going to come up here, so I'm just going to go invincible, okay, play. Okay. So I think it started over here. Around here. And you want to just get a rough idea of where everything is. And then it was unbreakable. And then unstoppable. And then unshakable. Okay, so I'm going to just do it for here, and let me just quickly play to see if we have it in the right area. So it's really cool. We got it all aligned properly. So now let's, let's pretend like we did the whole thing. Obviously, this is going to take a long time, so I'm just going to do it for this part. And obviously you would just continue on until you finish the whole song. So now I'm going to highlight everything and I'm going to do more styling now. So now I want font. So I'm going to highlight everything. And then I'm going to head over to the side and choose some fonts here that I think would do well. I want a font that's really big and huge. Because the song is very bold and loud. So I want something that matches that. Okay. I'm going to stretch it. Now I'm going to make everything quite a lot bigger in size. Let's see here. Okay, 
Okay, so now let's play with... This is just like a little test video here. So let me just play with the first one. Now you want to add animations and behaviors. So I'm going to add some behaviors because these are already pre-done by Camtasia. So they already have animation to them. So let's see what we would want here. If you hover over them, you can kind of see what they do. So I want something, let's see here, some, maybe something like that, the fly-in. I think I like the fly-in so far for this part. Let's try that. So I'm going to go fly-in. And then let's play that. Ooh, that was cool. I actually really liked that one, flying in. It was pretty, pretty bold and exciting. So let's see what it looks like if I add it to all of the text, because I actually really liked that. Okay, so that was a little bit fast for the rest of them. So let's see if I can slow that down a bit. Let me slow down the speed. It, it was at 90%. So let me see 80%. And there's a lot of playing around and tweaking around here and just seeing what works with the song. Cool. Okay, so that looked cool. But let's say, you know, we didn't want all of them to look like that. We wanted different animations. You can do that as well. So let's do different animations for the rest of the, the three words here. Let me just get rid of all these behaviors and I want to change them. So this one is going to be explode. So let's see what this one looks like. Oh, sorry. Let me just remove that. And we just want this one to be explode. Okay, so let's play this here. Alright, that looks cool. Let's do another one now. Let's do this drifting one for Unstoppable. Now I'm just showing you guys different types of behaviors on the lyrics that you can add. I'm just showing you guys different behaviors that you can add to the text. Personally, I wouldn't have each one going all different for this song, but I'm just showing you like an example. So let's play this one. Okay, that one's fine. And let's do the last one here. I guess let's try the jump and fall. Well, that was cool. Okay, so let's play all these together. So that looks pretty cool. Now you could even do something like this where you have everything on the screen. So let me move this one to the top here. Let me make this a little bit smaller. And then I'm going to just move every single person up by one. So they're one on top of the other. And you'll see what I mean here. And I'm just freestyling right now. And this is what I do all the time in order to create these types of videos is you just got to play around with things and find out what works. So I'm just trying to do a stylistic thing here. Let's see if I extend this what it looks like and I'm just gonna make it a little bit smaller put it right there and let's see invincible is going right there let's make that a little bit smaller something like that and then extend it And then let's see here, unbreakable. Put that over there. This might 
turn out to be really bad, like really crazy, but I'm just trying something out. So we'll see how it looks. It might look bad, it might look good, but in any case, you know, you gotta just play around with things to see how they work. So I'm gonna just make that smaller, put that down there, move this one just down there. So let's see how this ends up looking. It might look too crazy, but let's see. Oh, I forgot about unshakable. I forgot about the unshakable one. So let's see here. Maybe all those end before that one starts. So let's see here. And there's many different things that you could do. So let's try this. So there's many different variations that you can do. Obviously, I would still need to tweak this and ar arrange the words properly. But you guys can get the, the gist of it and the idea of it. So remember, keep in mind that doing lyric videos will take a while. And it's best to have the lyrics out in front of you. I had them here on the phone so that I could see the words coming up. Because if you just try and listen to it and then type it out, you're likely to make more errors and it's just gonna take a longer time. It's better if you can see the lyrics. And you know from here there's so much more that you can do. You can change the color of the text, change all of the different kinds of fonts, have different animations. You can you can even change these animations if you don't want to use behaviors. You can do all different kinds of things. So this video was to give you a basic idea of how to get started on creating a lyric video in Camtasia. Alright guys, well thank you so much for watching. If I was able to help you out at all, please let me know by giving this video a like, a comment, or subscribe. All that would be very much appreciated. And if you want to check out the Camtasia software, you can head down to the description below as I have the links for you guys. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.